tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. Well, a quiet night across West Michigan. A cold night at that, though. You're going to want to bundle up heading out tomorrow morning as we are already seeing cold temperatures down to 24 in Grand Rapids and Kalamazoo, 21 in Fremont and Big Rapids, 27 in Muskegon, and 26 in Holland. Wind chill here in Grand Rapids. Currently sitting at 18 degrees, same in Greenville. We are tracking an overcast and cool Saturday with a few lakeshore snow showers possible. Widespread light snow rolls in for us on Sunday with one to three inches of accumulation. And then we'll see on and off lake effects through at least Monday and Tuesday that could provide an additional one to three inches of accumulation. So grounds are likely going to be white by the middle of next week for a good portion of West Michigan. As we head through the day on Saturday, again, uh, tracking temperatures topping out of the mid-30s, but that's under overcast skies. Still, winds will be light, turning out of the south ahead of our next system. We also have the possibility of seeing a few snow showers along the lakeshore. In fact, this model does show uh, the possibility for some showers, especially near and west of US 31 from Holland up toward Muskegon. And so if you're in that area, don't be surprised if you see a few snowflakes come tomorrow. A wider view of Storm Track Live shows uh, we have this system we're continuing to watch that is going to be developing here over the next several days. Dives south and then turns back north. It's a classic Colorado low. And then by Sunday morning, we start to see some white to perhaps briefly moderate snow. Cold front rolls through Sunday night. And then we see the lake effect machine turn on. Not expected to be intense, but will be enough to add a few more inches onto the ground for our typical lake effect areas. And that will be under a west-northwest flow. And then you see we do hang on to snow chances for at least Wednesday. Snowfall through the end of the day Sunday at this point looks to range from about an inch for places like Cal uh, Kalamazoo, Battle Creek, uh, over toward the Lansing area to up to two to three inches for the Grand Rapids area, perhaps three to four inches for areas north of Muskegon. And then as we head into the day on Monday, uh, we could see an additional inch or two for our lakeshore communities and perhaps another inch on Tuesday. So we'll continue to see this light snow over the next several days. Uh, important to reemphasize that Saturday is going to be dry for just about everyone, but we do have the chance for a few showers in Grand Haven, Muskegon, over toward Holland. Otherwise, widespread snow Sunday. Many areas will see snow again on Monday, perhaps parts of Tuesday as well. And it's going to remain cold with lows in the 20s. So Byron feeling a lot more like winter uh, this weekend and beyond. Hey, it's no Christmas week blizzard from last year. That, that was <laughs> crazy, but you know, it's still something to watch out for. Yeah, right as we turn the page into the holiday season, the weather takes snow. All right, thank you, Blake.